Alright guys, today I'll be showing you how to jailbreak an iPhone 4 running iOS 4.3.3 in 2026 using Legacy iOS Kit. Right here I have my 2014 MacBook Air running macOS Big Sur. And I think Legacy iOS Kit I think works on macOS High Sierra and the latest version of macOS. Not really sure, but um, this is my first time using Legacy iOS Kit. So first off, we're going to get the iPhone plugged in, which I already did right now, the camera. All right, guys, so what you want to going to do is you're going to be opening up the iOS Legacy Kit folder. You're going to be going into your folder, and then you're going to open up your terminal. We are going to be dragging the restore.sh folder right here. We want the jailbreak option, so we're going to be using the arrow keys on the bottom when we're going to go and select jailbreak and you should put your iphone into recovery mode so i'm going to hit enter to put in recovery mode so it should be doing something so press enter again phone is already going into recovery mode as you can see right here but now what you're going to want to do is boot into DFU mode by holding the power button, which I'm not going to show on camera because the home button is sadly broken on this. Um, you want to go ahead and hold the power and home button. And what happens after that is it's going to boot into DFU mode. So when the Apple, um, when the iTunes screen shuts off on the iPhone, you're going to want to keep holding the power button for like five seconds and then hold the home button until, you know, it pops up in your computer. And we are now in DFU mode, so let the jailbreak process begin. And there we go, our iPhone is officially jailbreaking. Look at this guys. I've never seen anything like this in a long time. My iPhone 4 running iOS 4.3.3 is jailbreaking. And you will get a loading bar as you can see right here. That is the iPhone kind of restoring but modifying the operating system files. <laughs> Look at that. It looks like my friggin' computer's gonna glitch up at any moment. Releasing secret government code. And my iPhone has just restarted, as you can see right here. I think it will take a while to boot up since first jailbreaking. And Legacy iOS Kit is just the best tool you could ever use on your iPhone, like Legacy iOS devices. I just want to thank the developers very much for making this tool possible in 2026 especially. I mean, it's just the first day of 2026 and I reckon I might be the first ever person on the planet to jailbreak an old classic legacy device in 2026. And as you can see right here, I think that's Cydia, but the friggin' icon's glitched up. On second thoughts, here we go. And here we go, we're going to be opening up Cydia, as you can see right here. And I already did download the um, TLS root certificate, so Cydia will work perfectly. It's the unsigned iOS bundle, if you're questioning. And it's just verifying. And as you can see right here, when your iPhone restarts, you are fully jailbroken. There's Cydia right here. And there we go. We are officially jailbroken. Look at this. And I'm going to be more active in 2026. So thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.